Okay, well we've set up, we've got our two GoPros, we've got our flag. Um, I'll zero this little measuring tape app. And... So it's actually zeroed here at target. There we go, zero. So zero at target, and we're going to go around the roads to the top of the hill over there. So essentially, well it's just to the left of the top of the hill, essentially it's um, a little bit to the left of the left hand tower but I'll put a dot on the screen so you can see but we'll go up there now and um, sun's getting the right place and we'll we'll give it a shot Around, around the 4,006, 4,008 metres and 4,382 yards. I think it's settled. No, it's still chopping around. Oh, 4, 000, it's around the fourth, just over, around the 4,010 roughly metres. Okay. Ready. Tall and slightly right. Half a target right, one and a half targets tall. <sighs> Wind right going, on. winds changed, so. dust. Winds change, dust is going left to right, about two mile an hour. Left, one target low, two targets left. Left and tall. One and a half targets left, one target tall. Wind is obviously changing. That dust is hanging very, very slightly to the right. Left, level with bottom edge of target, two targets left. Did not say. Oh, 
I gotta say the bloody bugs and things are pretty phenomenal tonight. Yeah, it's just too warm I think we're left here today, but you ready? Yep. Left, level with bottom edge of plate, one target left. Oh, no. That was right where it should have been, innit? <laughs> yeah. One target left. Come on, Vision, there it is. Oh, to the right. Three o'clock, half a target right. Oh. <laughs> That's where I held. It was like level with the right leg of the target. Oh, just off the right edge of plate. Top right corner. Wow, <laughs> that was close. Tiny bit tall. Oh, just over top, one target tall. Nice and straight. Oh, just over top. Literally just over top. Wow. Like 12 o'clock. I can't imagine how it missed. Dust hanging. Top right, 130 off the edge of plate. Man, that's close. We got it. Ah, look at that. Yep, hit it. Well, I thought a couple of those no seas, I was right in here. Yes. Okay. <laughs> I got a light like always you couldn't see, but uh, no. awesome. Well, this is, got that's it. a proper hit. Yeah, um, bring the camera in, Sam, and we'll okay. show you exactly what that's like. That's a proper. Oh, look at that indentation. Yep. That whacked it. This is a fresh piece of, this is a fresh target I brought out. I thought, okay, we're, we're close enough now. We should be able to get on target, so we'll see if we can fresh run on. Not exactly the most centered hit you could get, but that's, <laughs> that's on it. at a 24 inch plate. Yep. Um, and to be honest, there's we didn't even know we'd hit one. Um, we, we're very, very close. There's should, there's a mark over here, there's a mark over there, there's a couple immediately over the top. Yep. Um, and there's obviously all these ones to the front, but um, it was a very awkward day to do it. It was low wind, so it was good on that score, but it was hotter. It really got to 35 degrees today. Um, and I really said we're not going to go out if it's over 32. Um, I changed the line, we came out on 32, it, it didn't drop off. So we were shooting in essentially a lot of um, mirage for me. Um, in the way of looking through the barrel, I had a lot of mirage on it. And 
the extra heat flies are just here. It wasn't very pleasant. We're looking into the sun, but um, and we just had plans to actually change our, our strategy and only come out on a 26 to 28 degree day on a cooler day so we could come out a little earlier where the sun isn't in our face so much and do the shot. But um, look at that a proper hit at 4,000 and what was it 4,384 yards. So um, awesome, we've done it. Yay! 24 inch plate. <laughs> uh, that was with our, for the people who asked the questions, that was with our 375 Gibbs, which is our own name for the cartridge. It's actually a 375 Shaytac rifle or Shaytac rifle um, in an improved chamber. So it means the chamber's taken out a little bit. I'll, I'll put a link on the video for what the bullets look like in difference. And we're shooting the Shaytac bullet. So it's the 350 grain solid copper Shaytac bullet. Um, and yeah, that's about the details. It did it. The gun's shooting great. It's obviously a really hard shot we're shooting. We've really got to pull off a one third MOA group to get this thing out at, out at just over four kilometers. So um, I'm wrapped and my little spotter here did an awesome job, got onto it, didn't uh -huh. see this, but you'd have to give a, um, the, the, um, the, that's got a, impossible to see with the fact we're just looking at the shadow of the, of the actual target um, and you just haven't got the definition, which you'll see in the long range shot. Um, we'll see what we have got there. Hopefully we've got where our projectile went. We've got a GoPro camera out there another one in here and hopefully one of those will tell us where our bullet went roughly and maybe even come out here with a metal detector and find our projectile as to what actually hit the target and both those can go on the mantelpiece but um thanks guys thanks for the support and um and thanks for checking us out and we'll catch you next time